Welcome to the first episode of Real to Real. Uh, my name is Andrew, and uh, this first episode is going to be on Punta Gorda, which was the first stop of the IFA tour. Uh, I went over there uh, to Tampa Wednesday night, stayed with my buddy. We did a little pre fishing uh, Friday and Saturday. Thursday didn't really uh, pan out for us with the rain and the storms. Uh, Friday, we hit up the Fort DeSoto area. Um, Found some trout, got a snook, not really what I was looking for. Saturday, we headed down to Placida and uh, found some reds and trout down there. Fortunately, I didn't really get anything on video. But uh, this first video is just going to be us pre-fishing the Fort Soto area. So check it out. Hopefully you like it. back hope you enjoyed that video that was us uh, again pre-fishing for DeSoto uh, again I didn't really get any video of us uh, pre-fishing Placida but that's where we did get on some reds and trout um, and that's where I decided to go Sunday morning for the tournament uh, we kicked off at 7 30 Sunday morning that was safe light time uh, got over to our spot we wanted to fish uh, managed the trout right off the bat it was small but it was something to, you know, at least start the day off. Uh, after that, I continued to drift this flat and worked my way over to this uh, big pothole. Uh, as I arrived there, uh, shortly after that, there was waves of redfish coming over this flat and just coming right into this pothole I was sitting on. Uh, it was uh, a little discouraging at first because I couldn't get anything to take. And uh, I decided to switch baits. I put on my uh, big Monsters 3X shrimp and put some Pro Cure on there. 
I uh, tossed it back into the pothole and found one that was hungry and it was a good one. You'll see that on the video. Uh, but it was, I was very grateful for that because it took away the pressure of finding a redfish and a trout. At this point, all I had to do was focus on trout, which is what I did immediately after that redfish. Um, I was able to upgrade that first trout. Not really what I wanted to upgrade to, but it was upgrade nonetheless. And without it, I uh, went to done as well as I did. So I'll let the video do the rest of the talking. Check it out. Hope you enjoy. There we go. Gosh, oh my gosh, look at this. Holy crap. Oh, gotta be kidding me right now. Here comes some more. Gosh. Yes, there we go. Yes! Good fish. Come on, God, keep them on. Good fish. Good fish. Good fish, thank you, God. Oh, come on. Oh, dude, that's a big fish. Yes, we're going.
trout. Nice trout. Upgrade. There you go. <laughs> Welcome back. As I was saying, I really needed, really needed another trout. Uh, I fished and fished and fished and could not find a decent trout. Um, that 18 inch was the best I could do. Was really, really hoping for something around the 22 inch mark, but um, just couldn't do it. Um, ended up with 29 and a half inch red and then that 18 inch trout. It put me at 47 and a half inches, which landed me 11th place, which was the last payout. And the funny thing is, is it came down to me and another guy. It was a tie. And the tiebreakers decided by who checked in first. And by God's grace, I checked in before him. I felt pretty bad that I was going home with a check and he was not. But um, it's just how it happens sometimes. Uh, the next tournament's going to be over in Texas. Should be the first weekend of April. I'm looking forward to it already. I know it's a few weeks away, but uh, I hope you guys look forward to that video. It should be pretty awesome. And thank you so much for watching Real to Real and check in next time. Thanks.